straight in a fucking gobber. Um, right down a sniffer. So the next one goes back to, we do, uh, this is probably around seven and a half years ago, so more than seven and a half years ago. We've been going out for around a month. And um, I was staying around Emily's house. And at this point, Emily only had one bathroom in our house. And it was downstairs. So it was the shared bathroom. Everyone in the family used it. I was downstairs in the bathroom. I had my pyjama shorts on, right? And you know when you sit down to take a shit, there's two toilet lids. The first one you lift up, and then you get the ring. That's the one that you shit on when you're taking a crap. So I was sat on there. And I was, um, my cock obviously was very small at this point. I must have had a shriveled up cold cock. Because where I'd basically, I'd, I'd taken a shit, well, I started taking a shit, and I realised that my fucking, I was standing in wet stuff, and I looked down and my pyjama shorts that were round my ankle were absolutely soaking. And I was like, what the fuck? So I picked up my pyjama shorts and sniffed them. They were covered in piss. It was piss all over my pyjama shorts. So my first immediate thought is, fuck me. The cat's pissed on the floor. The ca- I thought her cat, Toby, had pissed in the bathroom next to the toilet and I'd soaked my feet in pyjama shorts in it, right? So I washed my feet, I took my pyjama shorts and, and put them in the wash and um, I went upstairs and I told Emily and I told Emily's mum that I think the cat's pissed in the bathroom floor. Right, this is where I realised when Emily's mum had gone downstairs to clean the bathroom what I'd realised is that where I'd been sat in the toilet, I had pissed, because my dick was so shriveled up, I'd pissed through the gap in the toilet instead of down the toilet. So I'd pissed all over her toilet, pissed all over the bathroom floor, and all over my own feet and pyjama shorts. And um, her mum went downstairs and cleaned up all of my piss. <laughs> I was so embarrassed after realising that when her mum came upstairs and said that wasn't a cat, someone's pissed through the gap in the toilet, I blamed Emily and told her that I hadn't actually started going to the toilet yet because I realised I was soaked as soon as I sat down and that I hadn't even gone for a piss. Her mum told her off for being disgusting and Emily started crying afterwards and she was like, it wasn't me, I swear. And she was super embarrassed and her mum thought that she'd pissed through the seat and I didn't tell her for months. Literally didn't tell her for months that it was me. Her mum had... I'd been going out for her for a month and her mum was on her hands and knees mopping up my piss off her own bathroom floor. <laughs> And 